Welcome to Power Reviews Everything. Today, we are going to try to cut this kryptonite cable lock, bike lock, chain, or whatever you want to call it. And the reason why I'm doing this is because recently I bought a bike, the Diamondback Recoil, and uh, so I was looking for a chain for it, some way to lock it to my bike rack. And I had this, but then I looked on YouTube and I was showing how easy it was to get into. So, let's see if it's, a, I've seen all these videos, they, they basically had some kind of wire cutters, they were different types though, some fancy ones I think, um, and these guys were pros. So I'm curious to see how, if, 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 if a guy like me, <clears throat> that is not a thief with no experience, could he actually cut a cable lock. So, all I'm armed with is some wire cutters, and some basic ones at that. So, let us begin. Let's, let's do a, Start our time. I don't have a stopwatch, but let's just go for it. See if I can just cut it straight through. Which it doesn't seem like I can. So far, it's holding up. <clears throat> I did end up buying another kryptonite product, but it was a it was like a chain link. So far, so at least I would be delayed for sure if I was trying to steal this bike. The ones they showed on, on the videos that I've seen, he actually had wider clippers. This one's pretty now. I can't really get into it. Sure, if I make it any, am I cutting anything? I don't know. I am or not. I tell you, my hand is getting sore though. I hear things are sound like it's crunching, so I'm assuming I'm cutting into it. Oh, I think I am. Working up a sweat over here. Let's so take a look so far. I think I got through some. Could I do it? It's definitely taking some time. If I was trying to steal a lock, time is important. The videos I've seen, they cut it through. They cut through. I mean, it was like almost instantaneous. Like was it five or six seconds? But they were obviously professionals, and they obviously had probably better tools for a job. I'm gonna pop it for a second because I wanna take off my sweater. Okay, I'm back. And I didn't I didn't fast forward or anything, we're still at the same place. I just took off my sweater. I'm gonna get an examination. I didn't bring my glasses, which probably would have helped, but yeah, I cut through some, some stuff. This is not even a good pair of clippers either. They're old and probably very dull. Let's see if I can do something. So it does seem to be getting through. Oh, my hand. Oh! Definitely would not make the greatest thief in the world for myself, but let's see. Can I get through it? Can I get through it? Oh, 
Yeah, I'm almost through. Look at that. Can you see that? I'm not looking at the camera, so I don't know. But that looks like I'm just about through. Oh, my can. Can is shot. I'm close. Oh yeah, very close. You can do it, here comes the Kapopo. Here comes the owner. I gotta hurry. Almost there. Ah, the last two strings. My hand is just done. It is done, I tell you. Thing for you guys, you can fast forward through this board stuff and then get to the conclusion, which will be that I will get through this thing because I'm almost there. Oh, all right, Usha. Here we go, last part. Have like one strand that's really strong, and all the rest is just weak. The one tungsten strand or something. Oh, wait a minute. Look at that. So close. Ah! Ta ta! Your bike is stolen! I stole your bike. It only took me what? About six and a half minutes. But if I had the right tools, I'm sure I could have got through there much faster with no experience. So, that shows you how strong it is. With these small little pliers, I got through it. it took me forever, but I think a good pair of pliers, or not a pliers, but clippers, I could have knocked it out, I'm sure, within a minute. So do what I do, get yourself a, one of the link, not a regular chain, chain link, they have some, I'll show you later, another review of my my other chain, but I'm not gonna cut it, because I'm not gonna be able to, that's for sure, not with this. Well, thanks for watching, Paul reviews everything.